What's up, YouTube? This is Broad52, and I am finally back. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you. I left for the weekend. I went to Galveston with a bunch of my friends, and we stayed in a little beach house, and it was awesome, and I got sunburned, and it was incredible. Honestly, one of the best weekends of my life. It was insane. Um, and basically, what this video is about, it's going to be my first, first video back. And in five days, I go back to school to start my sophomore year at Booker T. Anyway, back to the point, I'm going to make a follow-up video on my five things I don't like about 2.0.0. And I made this video two months ago, and I was a wee lad of 300 hours. I now have 900 hours, 915 hours on Dead by Daylight in the span of two months. I don't even know how, I'm, but I know a lot more about the game, I'm a lot more informed. I've seen many, many dev streams, and I actually made a script of this video before I left for my two-week vacation way back in Ju July. I never actually published that one. But this is going to be a better video because I actually know what I'm talking about this time. So, let's get started. So basically, the main thing that I noticed about my, um, my old video was that I didn't even know what vacuum pallets were. Vacuum pallets is where the survivor will teleport to the other side of a pallet when they throw it down, preventing the killer from getting a hit. I thought it was the idea that if you would flip the pallet on the wrong side, that's not what that is. The new update made it so you had to be on the other side of the pallet to throw it down, which was better and balanced, and I realize that now. It, and it was also the fact that the pallets were actually glitched in the public test build, and once they were put into the actual game, they were completely fixed, and it works fine, so there's your answer to that. Also, Kate's perks still suck, by the way. I won't change my mind about that. The, the best one is not Boil Over. It's actually Dance With Me. Um, I found myself playing Killer, and that one actually kind of tripped me up a little bit, especially when you don't see it coming. So um, her best perk is Dance With Me, and even that one is not is no decisive strike or anything. Clown, he's more balanced than I thought he was. I, I'm actually going to make a Killer tier list, since the Trapper and Hag buff, and I'm going to rank every killer from top to bottom, since no one's done that yet on the internet. So I'm going to be the first one to do that, and it's going to be a good meme, I think. Well, who cares anyway? Um, and then also, oh, what were my other points? The shop, eh, the shop was okay. I didn't really find myself buying anything from the shop. Um, I like the way the shrines are, the, uh, the... It's 2,000 for your iridescent shards in the shrine. I feel like that's really good and works better than the other one, actually. Basically, in general, 2.0.0 was solid, and honestly, I really don't have anything bad to say about it. A lot of it was just came with Chapter 8, the only real problems, which weren't even problems. They were just like, eh, it's a bad perk, it's not that important, but a lot of it came with Chapter 8, not the patch. The patch was really, really good, and I really had no understanding of how far the game actually has sunk since uh, since 2.0.0. Because before 1.9.4, which is what which one which is the one that I first played the game on 1.9.4, um, 1.9.2. I did not know of the horrors of 1.9.2 at that point, and now I know. And the more you know. This was a good, very, very good patch compared to that one. So, praise be to 2.0.0. Thank God it happened. Thank God this new one is going to reflect on some of the things that 2.0.0 made other people a little bit about. Um, which is basically just the glitchiness of unhooks and pallets, and they're actually going to fix that in the next one. And also, Ritz getting his big boy buff, and Freddy's buff is coming very soon, so big things are coming in the future, lads. Let's get that hype train going, and very soon. Very, very soon. 
I'm going to be coming out with my killer tier list of 2.1.1. So yeah, this was this video. It was very short. I just wanted to reflect on some things and don't look at that video anymore. I did not know what I was talking about. So also very important. I'm getting my new PC in a couple weeks. So you'll be expecting some live streams and some Dead by Daylight footage very soon. Very, very, very frequently. I'll probably post several videos a day about Dead by Daylight, and hopefully it's going to work out. So, that's that. I hope you guys knew this video. If you did, please leave a like and comment on your music. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.